Oh, uh, now we're going to fight the boss. Um, let's pick up all this stuff. It's always a good sign when there's half a ton of ammo. I know, guns, isn't that's it? racking up the tension. I know. Um, now I've forgotten all about this boss. I'll oh, pick up this. You're cheap to the eyes and the ears. Now I noticed there was... Ah, see, look, there's tons of enemies. Ah, you kind of got to... Alright, in fighting. In fighting's the word, word of the day. <laughs> okay. I'll just <laughs> try to skip round the edge here. You've not even seen Captain Buffoon. Oh, he's just sitting on his chair. And, uh, oh, no, oh know, God. Pantaloon squad. Is he still sitting? Oh, no, no, he's there. I saw him. He's in the tree. Well, well, I'll get to him once. I mean, how did that guy conquer this place? He's a complete and utter... Oh, I saw him like, for a second, like, like a, a little bit. Pirate the kid's pantomime. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, there's all sorts going on. Oh, look, oh, look at that shaman okay. guy's like... There he oh, is. he's getting hit by everyone. Yeah, he does have some problems. Ah, uh, oh, really oh, I'll pick up that. Ow. <laughs> oh, hang on, there's a board bullet here. Oh, look, there's him. Remember him? Oh, yeah, he's back. He followed you all the way here. Oh, oh. 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 Okay, I got oh, a program no. error. Stack uh, overflow. Stack overflow? Oh. Okay, well, it's... I think what I should do is I should actually attack them as well. Because yeah. maybe there was, a, like, overflow it's with too many enemies. Too many. I think it was definitely Fitzquake I ran this with when I did it. Oh, well, Fitzquake yeah. is the most stable, yeah, but... I don't know if it was the one that runs with Nahara, it's slightly smoother than Fitzquake, but I don't know. Uh, well, I, sure. I used, I used, when I built uh, Nahara, I used, uh, Fitzquake, I, I think. Oh, oh I no, no, it comes no, with no, build, I'm sure. Yeah, you're right, no, I think you're right, actually, I, don't, I can't remember if it was the thing that I came with. It came with. Oh, okay, I get... You don't hurt my ammo. So oh, I'll say that. Good, uh, yeah, I should just say it. I'll, I'll go down the ones that are like the most numerous. Uh, yeah. So you think there's a lot of them? Uh oh, get away! I'm trapped. I think I've taken out a lot of them. Oh, oh, he's actually stuck. He's making an attempt at the throne. Oh. That shambler wants, wants the throne and the He does. <laughs> I'll just like take out of the weak ones. If they did kill you, what would they do? Oh, the, what the hell? The <laughs> that was nasty. That was. Oh, the video says he's got like a tin head. Look at him. Look at his gun. It's like a plastic pouch stretcher toy. He's Can't get a good look at it. Really. Oh, he's actually. I mean, it's, all those minions were a complete waste because it's just all it's doing is taking his health down. Yeah. Like you'd expect. Oh, I'm gonna send all these just guys after you in order to like waste well, your health I and stuff. It was such a funny. But he spent more time. Into it himself. <laughs> we just boot a shambler across the so. <laughs> Look, they're both attacking them as well. This is a three-way battle for the throne. I'm gonna get... Oh, this what is, is that attack? This is Game of Thrones to? Series 5, ah. guys. Sorry, their budget tanks after Season Do I have a rocket launcher? No, I don't. There was no rocket launcher in this game. No. Right. You know what? Uh, I'll just... Uh, oh yeah, of course you can. Well, you can, but they take half damage. Aye. He does have a ludicrous amount of health, actually. Whee! There's <laughs> a lot of damage. Yeah, it's funny, it, 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 it seems like it's a lot, but it doesn't, it barely takes no, anything away. Actually, but it's got that shock effect. Oh, he jumped the shambler. Right, okay, I'm gonna save. Good idea. Okay, um, what will we use? I'll just have to use grenades. I like how it's called audience. Does that mean every time he has someone over, there's just a big brawl? <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. Ooh, quad damage. Nice. If only we'd remember that. So we best you'd use the double barreled shotgun because that'll... Well, at least you can be sure to get... There, there we, go. we go! God, he's got an ogre head. Assuming I throw in your grate. Oh no, he's got a normal head. But you had a tin helmet on. Well, you saw that. There we go. <laughs> That's the back of the throne. There you go. Congratulations. Thus the Duke of Ontranto. He was a Duke. He was. Duke Nukem. Slain by a lone Mithrine. I take it out. It's the old, ye oldie spelling of Marine. Oh, right, okay. I, I actually quite like this little bit. Ah, because that's the way that the, the ogres would pronounce it, perhaps. <coughs> or, or the old ones, or whatever you call them. Mm. Later, others of his tribe came and set their standard over us, and declared a strange thing, that they had liberated us from evil, and that the great lords were servants of that evil, which they claimed was more vile than a cursed cough. And they named it Quake. So basically they brought the Bill of Rights to Quake. Oh, okay, hang on, let me just read this again. So, a, a lone marine uh, 
killed the Duke of Otranto. Later, others of his tribe came, so more humans came and set their standard over us and declared a strange thing that they had liberated us from evil. So it's kind of like occupation. <coughs> yeah, uh, it's like the forces of Earth are like pushing out and, occu and now li liberating uh, in inverted commons the places that were. Oh, uh, okay. Being so it's, it's like Operation Quake. Iraqi Freedom, basically. More or less, but set in. In Quake. Uh, on so it says, <laughs> and they named it Quake. So basically, this evil. Um, well, I think it's because Ed Software were so unclear about what Quake was uh, in the game. In in their in their yeah. circle, he was a D and D villain they invented for. Aye, uh, but they never you never actually get to see him because Shub is the ba the the big bad. Yeah, and that she's obviously uh, derived from uh, Lovecraft. Aye, uh, so the the great evil, which is basically, um, yeah, so basically that's the kind of amorphous force of evil is technically called Quake. Yeah, I mean the thing is he's described in the manuals as a he, but I think it's implied that he's he is kind of a yeah you know a sort of a force rather than anything else. Well, it's know? a kind of personification like humans do of of a big yeah. nameless force. Yet how can this be? The great lords were kindly unto us, gave us blessings, and where needed chastisement. Yet the marines see them as enemies, threats to be seen and destroyed. Who tells the truth? Oh, okay. Yeah, well, that's quite an interesting little. Yeah, I mean. That, that is interesting, it's like, you, that's the place you can really put all this stuff in Quake. Yeah. Kind of. Well, I suppose you can have readable text in that, to a certain extent. Or unless extent, you're doing a higher and, and do your Oh yeah, the whole cutscene films. Film, but yeah, well there we go. That was that was pretty good, actually. Um, yeah. The, the levels were, the levels were actually, yeah, they were they were pretty decent. Um, they were a bit confusing. Yeah. Um, particularly that village one that you did. That was like the most confusing. It was, and yet, and yet, even second time around, I got through it relatively quickly. Yeah, you know, I don't know. It's 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 a funny one that because there is enough difference in in the different areas that you, I think you do get a a sense for the whole place. You know what I mean? Yeah, I mean the boat, the boat and the the village are different from each other, and and the the yeah. underground tomb. <coughs> so each one is kind of a different theme. It's not like a series of levels which yeah. are too samey. But um, no, I think that yeah, the last one was definitely confusing. I will I will admit, I, but at least it's. I don't know, and maybe, I don't know if it could have been split into two, maybe. Um, well, I mean, it seemed almost the size of one episode of Quake. I had, like, five levels, but some of those levels were pretty massive. Yeah. Um, yeah. But, yeah, well, anyway, there we go. So that yeah. was uh, on Tranto. Uh, we'll, down. we'll probably do another Quake um, custom level soon. Uh, if you've got any that you can think of. We were thinking of doing Travail, because I, I remember playing, you showed me Travail ages yeah, ago, and, yeah. and I was really impressed. Travail never fails to fail. Self and sorry. Yeah, you it's just go it <laughs> and play all yourself. I'm going by side now. Um, yeah, but that's that's a good one. But if there's any other ones that you that you want to bring to our attention, then well, yeah, just do so in the comments, and um, hey. we'll probably get round to them. So thanks yep. for joining us. This is Lizard Jeans and what Danny signing out. Cheers, pal. Bye.